Monica Ward here. I'm so excited to tell you a little bit about my coaching story and how I got started in all of this awesomeness. First of all, I just want to tell you a little bit about my rank. So I'm a 14 star diamond elite coach. I was the 13th millionaire in the company. I'm also a success story winner. I uh, was able to lose 40 pounds when I first got involved in, in the company and I've maintained a healthy weight since 11 years ago, uh, October when I hit my 90th day on my first fitness program. And that takes me back to where was I 11 years ago when I first got started in Beachbody. I got started in Beachbody because I was looking for something to improve my health I think uh, parents can relate to this. Uh, Dave and I had just had our second child. He was turning three months old and our daughter was a busy, dynamic two-year-old who um, just was watching our every move. You know, if I was frustrated with traffic, she would mimic me and be frustrated with traffic. If I said a prayer for our family, she said a prayer for our family. So I realized as a parent, I had a choice. I could um, model healthy, um, incredible behaviors for her, or I could uh, lead her down a path that I wasn't going to be proud of as a parent. And it's amazing how children will hold you accountable to higher standards. And that's exactly what my children did. So. Luckily, I was up in the middle of the night and I caught an infomercial. At the time, the infomercials were not running like they're running now. Thank goodness they're running all hours of the day now. Um, in fact, when I caught that infomercial, I thought I was dreaming. I like went through the channels for the next 90 days, desperate to try to catch that infomercial again. I still just, I was so asleep when I saw the infomercial. You're probably like, how is that possible? Well, I used the TV for light when I would feed my son in the middle of the night for the night feedings because I didn't want to wake up Dave. He still had to get up and go to work and I was on maternity leave, so I didn't want to bother him. Um, but moving forward from that story, our product came in the mail. It was a 90-day boot camp. We alternated cardio and strength training, things I'd never been conscientious of before. And I really just took my journey one day at a time and started to document it. At the time, we would um, congregate on message boards. Now we have Facebook private groups and there's so much more opportunity to connect and text message and smartphones. None of that was available 11 years ago. And I felt amazing connections with people. Well, now we, we not only can we connect online, we actually meet up twice a year and then we have an annual vacation that we can earn. So there's so many ways for us to build memories, not only for business, but also with our family. In fact, I just told my children because they'll be in school while uh, we go on this year's Beachbody adventure uh, that they will not be joining us. And you would have thought I said the worst thing ever. So that's another thing. We, we might have to reconsider that as uh, the days approach. So I stayed very connected to a community to keep myself accountable first, right? Jim Rohn says, um, let me take care of me so I can better take care of you. And I love that saying because I think sometimes as parents, we put ourselves on the back burner or um, we don't want to have any indulgences beyond what is necessary. And that doesn't serve anyone and that doesn't allow you to have the energy and um, the, you know, the presence for your family. So I'm super grateful for Beachbody for giving me my health back and for helping me lose the unhealthy pounds that I had gained over the years and for getting me on the path to making it not about me. Moving forward, when coaching was presented to me, that was a really exciting time in my life because I didn't have any expectations, in all honesty. Uh, I couldn't visualize myself being the 13th millionaire in the company. What I knew I could do was set aside my ego, my fear of failure, 
my um, my ooh, lack of desire to take risks and I could put other people's needs first. I could be in control of my ability to listen. I could be in control of overcoming the fear to share something so valuable in my life um, and fearlessly share it with other people so they too could experience the great things that have come out of my getting healthy and fit. That's what started the path was getting healthy and fit. But really what turned my life around was the business. So one of the things that this business, and it is a vital behavior in our business, other than making sure that your proof the product works, that's you know doing the workouts and drinking our Shakeology, this, one of the vital behaviors is that we commit to personal development. So that might be through listening to audio that makes your life better. That might be listening or reading to books and of course developing your spiritual side. So that commitment to becoming a better person because I wanted to be a better coach for people and it was literally 10 minutes or 10 pages of my day each day has resulted high seven years later in me being a better parent, a better granddaughter. I'm thinking of the immediate people in my life, a better daughter, a better wife, and um, putting my marriage first, putting my children first. I mean, taking care of myself, understanding that I have to continue this journey, that every day I could take three steps backwards for the three steps forward that I took in the past, that it's so important that I stay committed to my journey as well. Um, and really, it's the new people who put that fire in my belly, that, that their enthusiasm for this, the opportunity that stands in front of them gets me really excited for them. So as coaches, I really keep it simple. I make sure that I am not with my face in my phone or completely checked out in life. I love to make observational comments, get to know people, meet people, um, mingle. I love connecting online. I love being part of groups. I love creating content that isn't like I have some kind of a master's degree in this. I really just um, make an effort to document what I'm doing and share it with others. I'll give you an example. This is a genius concept. So with um, the, the new programs that we have out right now, one of the servings of protein are eggs. So you would think that it's, I'm like a genius, that I actually documented that I boil a dozen eggs every week and chill them in my fridge. So we have that grab and go protein for our commitment to our nutrition, right? Genius, huh? So that's why I'm a Beachbody millionaire because I shared how to boil eggs and store them and chill them in your refrigerator. No, that's not why. Um, what happened was we created an amazing culture on this team of people who genuinely care about you and want to help you achieve a healthy and fulfilling life by pointing you to the products to get you started right on your health and fitness journey and to teach you how to get out of your own way and help others get started on their health and fitness journey as well. And when you do that, you get a commission for your efforts. So it's not about profiting off of other people or driving them to a sale. I didn't come in here with any sales experience. I can tell you what I became a professional at was a professional listener and a professional sharer. And the first two people who joined the business with me were two moms, just like me. In fact, actually, I take that back. They have each, each of my two first coaches 
um, are moms of four. So they put me to shame as a mom of two. Um, and we were just accountability buddies from the park. And one of the girls I developed a relationship with um, through our accountability groups online. And the, and the other girl was a mom from the park. So these women have transformed my life because they are so committed to their children, to their marriage, and yet still run prosperous businesses in Beachbody because they continue to stay committed to their health and fitness, documenting their journey and sharing it with others so they can invite those people to come, come, come to our next challenge group. So every month, we put out a challenge group and we invite people. Is this your month? Is this the month that you're going to step forward and get committed to your nutrition and your fitness and take a leap of faith and get the products that have been proven to have changed thousands and thousands of lives for the better? In fact, I think that the coaching community is like at 200,000 now. That's craziness, craziness. Um, considering it started with me. It started with one person in my, in my team, and then I invited two people, and then I invited more people, and it went on from there. And so um, I think it's really important for you to manage your expectations and understand that you will master this, that all of the tools have been tested, that they're all available, that all you have to do is become a professional sharer while simultaneously building your own personal testimony and the authenticity of that testimony is going to motivate people to take action. And it's not really important whether the people are ready now or they're ready in three months from now. You focus on the people who raise their hand at the moment and you continue to share your journey and you continue to help people move in the direction that's going to dramatically change their life forever. And that's what coaching is to me. It's the cumulative effect of seven years of every single day waking up and saying, today, who can I help? Who can I serve? And from there, going ahead and following through with what I said I was going to do, helping them get started right, inviting them to be part of our community, embracing them and welcoming into it them into that circle, and teaching them how to then be a contributor, add value, and, and uh, do the same with their circle of influence. I'm so excited that you're here and that you took the time to listen to my story. Obviously, I could go on and on and on, but I'm, I am wanting to let you get to know some of the other coaches and some of the other great things out there.